Melissa revealed that Meghan may be splitting her time between a Beverly Hills hotel and the pursuit of Gordon to open a store near her suite. Meghan Markle appears to be dedicating more time to the Beverly Hills Hotel as she seeks a Hollywood career comeback. Earlier this year, there were rumors of Meghan establishing a base in a hotel suite near the Los Angeles talent agencies William Morris and Deere, and it seems she's still conducting meetings at the Beverly Hills Hotel. She was recently seen outside the hotel and even appeared in a selfie alongside a group of enthusiastic fans, which was shared on social media. Meghan might be using this luxurious hotel as her base, especially considering her 11 million pounds home in Montecito is roughly an 85 mile, at least a 90 minute drive, without traffic from West Hollywood. The photo was shared by broadcaster Jen Su, who originally posted it on Instagram as part of a series of images related to the Beverly Hills Hotel. One picture displayed the hotel's logo on a note, while another gave a glimpse of the hotel's lobby. Jen described the experience as arriving in Los Angeles and unexpectedly running into Meghan Markle, noting how it was a fantastic way to start her trip. She later shared the selfie again in a separate post, mentioning that she landed in La and encountered Meghan Markle, who was very low-key and friendly, engaging in a pleasant conversation. Jen didn't offer more details about the interaction, except when asked in the comments if Prince Harry had been with Meghan, to which she replied that Meghan was by herself. Melissa Leonard, who was in the selfie along with Madison Leonard, also shared the photo and tagged the hotel. According to a source close to Melissa Leonard, Meghan had been frequenting the Beverly Hills Hotel, possibly trying to impress Gordon Gyllenhaal or another affluent individual who isn't Harry. It's speculated that Meghan's motive for cozying up to the reclusive Gyllenhaal, aside from the obvious pursuit of substantial financial deals following Netflix and Spotify, may involve the Gyllenhaal family's influential connections, particularly their relationship with California Governor Gavin Newsom. Observers suggest that Meghan could be lobbying for Gordon's assistance to influence the governor's appointment of a U.S. senator from California, as Dianne Feinstein is expected to resign due to a Gen health constraints before the next election. This news comes in the wake of warnings that Meghan Markle's reputation may be irreparably damaged and spending tens of millions of dollars on a PR makeover won't be successful. Meghan has been told that she is highly unpopular on both sides of the Atlantic and her reputation has been damaged beyond repair. It's a predicament she has inflicted upon herself and no amount of money can mend the damage. The American and British public now see through her attempts to salvage her image.